high school. Hi, this is Marina and Brittany, and we have watched an amazing Canadian-based show called Wild Wild. From the perspective of a child, this show is really fun and exciting. Um, what I really liked is seeing Kratz brothers change into different animals and wear the suit. It made, really made me want to have a suit like theirs and be able to like change into spiders and zebras and all that cool stuff. Um, my favorite part about the show was how the brothers saved the spiders, even though they're super gross and scary. Um, and spiders help us by eating all the bad bugs that eat the plants that we eat. Um, as a parent, I absolutely love the show. My kids are learning so much about animals. They love the show, they actually remember things, and especially a little trivia about different animals. Another thing is that my kids are actually getting excited about learning science in school. They associate the word science with uh, the show. And because they love the show, they're actually looking forward to getting uh, science taught to them as a subject at school, and it's fantastic. Um, my uh, personal favorite part about the show is that um, they encourage kids to write letters to them. They encourage kids to send requests, to ask questions, and the best part is they actually respond. And they send a the response in a timely manner. My children wrote a letter, and within 30 days, they had a beautiful, bright envelope in the mail. And uh, it had an autograph poster. Um, it was a semi generic, a little bit customized content. But they used my kids' names, which made them feel like a million bucks. Um, and uh, my two children are actually swearing that their California Bold Eagle episode was created only because. They were like requesting it. Oh, come on. Um, kids also got some VIP tickets. Um, oh, I can't use them so because right. it's a Toronto-based show, and it was yeah. a VIP passes to a Toronto Children's Museum of Natural like History. Like the, uh, <laughs> but we'll again, it's a really good perk, and it made my kids feel special. They're the age uh, where it's important musicians. for them to have and role she, like, models, so and I would rather have them be giant fans of Wild Crabs Brothers, someone who loves animals and takes care of animals and gets them excited about science. Um, another thing is my kids downloaded an iPad um, application of Wildcats, so they get a chance to follow up on stories, they get a chance to uh, have special videos of episodes before they come out on the screen, they get to play game, take quizzes, and most importantly, earn points. Oh yeah. That is really interesting. So, from the perspective of a teacher, uh, this one's going to be a little bit like a child development specialist, but focusing more on content. Uh, the scientific content focused on in the show is amazing. They make sure to engage children so deeply in every aspect of biology and how, how an animal walks, how it lives, habitats, diversity, no, it's just yeah. amazing. They also yeah, focus there. on curriculum standards as laid out by the National Science so cool. Ed Education yeah. Standards from the National yeah. Academy of Sciences with benchmarks like for science the, literacy the, from American Association for the Advancement of, of Sciences. Wow. Okay. Yeah. Their home they approve. <laughs> <They're all, laughs> the um, of primary um, importance for this age group is to provide an inquiry-based education. Approach. So we want them to ask questions, we want them to wonder, we want them to explore for themselves, and that's what really what the show provides. Um, the process is... I lost my intro. Okay, um, in my girlfriend is like, it's so... Okay. Encouraging viewers to ask questions, complete investigations and observations, answer questions, and present results. This process is modeled by the characters and is central to each and every story. The fact that our successful heroes use an inquiry-based approach to life and learning and our perpetual <laughs> successful villain does not sends a clear message that children to children about the inherent value of critical thinking skills. Okay. Um, so, okay. Oh, sorry. So, um, so the learning goals of the Wildcats are to teach the kids six to eight years old uh, natural history and age-appropriate science. And uh, the show really capitalizes on the kids' natural interest in animals and science. 
Um, it develops basic skills and understanding. Uh, it develops their observational skills, investigation of the animals. And it, most importantly, builds excitement and enthusiasm in kids about learning science. Um, educational, it is timely, smart, fun. Um, the, con the characters are definitely also enthusiastic and confident, and they provide good role models to the kids. Um, the actual content is always very seamlessly integrated with the stories. So the kids learn about the world, the science, through animals and the characters. And um, whether they're exploring some type of turtle or an eagle or a gross spider, um, they learn concepts there. For instance, why would worms come out from their underground home when it rains? Kids learn that in a very fun and interactive manner. Um, from child development specialists, I believe the show promotes pro social concepts, defining pro social sure, behavior sure as <laughs> voluntary behavior that's aimed for the benefit of not yourself but others. And the Wild Cats brothers, they set out on adventures and they go out of the ways to help animals in trouble. And kids uh, watch that, that oh, wow. behavior being modeled for them for social behavior. And the research uh, points out to positive relation between watching pro social television and um, advancing right. pro social skills in children. Children and also uh, decreasing so externalized behaviors like aggression. Uh, research further shows that uh, that uh, impact that the for social TV viewing has on children it lasts uh, even after two years. Another benefit of the show out, is like, that it uh, know, sparks dialogue between parents, and uh, parents and educators can take advantage of that by uh, sure having to ask questions like, there's there's no way you're and right. it actually <laughs> turns into interactive learning with the family. Um, and very last interesting point is that uh, PBS.org, uh, the town of Wellcrest, actually made a parent site where they give yeah. parents who might help know the strategies, is, they give them cues and like, strategies on how to engage like, the you children are dumb, you are in the, learning. Like, Thank you for watching yeah. our seven-minute <laughs> video. I'm 22. I <laughs>